The biggest stars in music know how to light up a stage with electrifying performances, but they also know how to shut down a red carpet with fashions that gave us life. Here to guide us through our Grammy fashion journey, it's fashion correspondent Amanda Garrigus. Hi, Amanda. Welcome back. Oh it's it so good, good to see you. you. Oh. Yes, it's it so truly good did. to see you. Yes. Well, we have to kick off tonight with a star who took fashion to the next level. That's Miley Cyrus. Yes. yes. Oh, my gosh. She brought it on the red carpet. She brought so many looks. We're going to start with this one. This is Maison Margiela. It was made out of 1,700 gold safety pins. What did we think about it? I loved it. I was a, a little bit obsessed. I thought it was great. I right? thought it was insane. I thought this is the kind of dress we'll be talking about for years to come. I mean, I, I loved the hair. It felt effortless, even though I know a lot of effort went <laughs> a into it. A lot of it, effort right? went into yeah. that hair. So, But she had so many looks. So we're going to yeah. go to the next one okay. when she accepted her award, oh. the first one of the night. She wore this Tom Ford jumpsuit. I loved it. It was like an homage to the 70s. She yeah. looked incredible. So did Mariah, by the way. And then, I mean, she did five looks. So we're going to go to the next one when okay. she performed, because this is one of my favorites oh. of the night. Can we I talk can. about this I one? Can. This one was Bob Mackie. And we know it was an homage to Tina Turner, yes. right? And Bob Mackie collaborated with Tina Turner. This moment, guys, I mean... Am I right? The no, way no. gorgeous this was? I'm telling you right what? now, this woman's a rock star. She is like the last living rock star of <laughs> our generation. Okay. She is 100% a fashion icon yeah. as well. She's it was amazing. All She's right. Miley had a zillion more looks. Yes, we, she we're going to run out of time, Rose. Okay. Between, yeah, 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 yeah. Between all the yeah. corsets, the opera gloves, the trains, it felt like sort of this old Hollywood glamour was one of the biggest trends of the night. Let's yes. discuss. Yeah, so let's start with Taylor Swift, who looked extraordinary. So some of the classic elements in the Taylor Swift look is the opera gloves. So mm -hmm. it's not new, but we see opera gloves a lot on the red carpet. Yeah. Of course, Taylor making this sort of a part of a statement about her new music launching. Mm -hmm. You know, you be the judge. Of course. So we love this. And Victoria Monet, she came out in the corset. Looks. Right. Versace, so extraordinary in this Versace it. look. I absolutely loved, loved, loved it. And corsetry, classic of the genre. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then from her, Fantasia also did yeah. an opera glove. What did we think? It about? was right? beautiful. So, so beautiful. I thought it was very like old glamour and then the neat lip jewelry thing was like yeah. took it into 2024 which, yeah. and she's yeah. so gorgeous having such a moment I love Amazing. it and then, right and silhouettes can also be classic so Kelly Clarkson yeah. she wore this classic sort of mermaid silhouette <gasps> it's a wow. how stunning right it took your breath away she <laughs> that's really exactly was how I felt. beautiful that's and you could tell she was feeling herself right yes. okay. and that's and the best I honestly I think that's the best she's ever looked I love I it agree. so much I agree and Olivia Rodrigo oh. I really I, we have to give homage to this dress because it's a column dress this dress came off of a runway from the 90s Linda Evangelista wore it I think she she looks extraordinary. And I love Did that you know she this? does this in her fashion. What yeah. she does is she wears old dresses and she makes them modern. Yes. I learned that from Zana Rossi Roberts. Okay. Yes. And I'm loving this moment for her. I'm I, loving this moment. Yes, I, I really love the old Hollywood. You don't normally see that at the Grammys because yep. it's more like rock go crazy, you know, but mm -hmm. it was it was fantastic. All right. Yes. Do we well, have you know, I love old Hollywood glamour, but yeah. I also love when they show off mm -hmm. some skin. Mm -hmm. And we had some ladies bearing it all last night. <laughs> yes, it's like the assignment for the Grammys is yes. show body. Uh -huh. Okay, and I'm telling you, Halle Bailey brought it. She knew the assignment. She wore this custom Gucci dress, which was so beautiful. It was sheer. It showed all of this sort of detailing on it. It yes. was extraordinary jaw-dropping. Loved it. Beautiful, beautiful. Right. And a cold day in L.A. yesterday to be yeah, this naked on the red she carpet. Didn't yeah, care. she was not wearing a no. lot of clothes. <laughs> uh -uh. Neither was her sister, okay. who was also wearing this sort of cut-out look that I yeah. thought looked extraordinary on her. It looked like a long dress from the front. It looked like a mini from the back. There she is. I mean, look at all those abs sitting out. Very I loved pretty. it. And she bought her sister's Little Mermaid hair, yes! which I am dying for <laughs> right here. I really am dying for it. Okay. Not borrowed the hair. Right? Right? And, okay, let's go. Let's go to Doja Cat because oh. talk about showing body. Yeah. Doja is not shy. She doesn't care what we think, and I love her for that. But I want to talk about this look anyway. Um, and if you had any question about who the designer was, it was written all over her face, guys, right there on her forehead, Delara. Oh, um, wow. This dress is fully that. sheer. I know, yeah. right? I was like, what is that? That's yeah. the name of the designer. I love when young artists wear young designers. Like, yeah. I've Very never heard cool. of Delara, but it seems like this is a brand she can grow with. Yeah. Yep. And we'll see much more of Delara on this red carpet now. I, I love, love you. that. I love you for this.
this. Yes. Can we talk about Dua Lipa and her Courage Please. dress? It's, it was so beautiful. This was one of the moments that I love because Courage is like a fashion lover's brand. So she's showing body in a different way, slits at the hip, but then this plunging neckline. I mean, it was so extraordinary. Dress is heavy. She brought the look. It was fire. You could tell that she felt good in this. Like, yeah. I felt like when she walked the carpet, she was just like, yep. Yeah. I'm it. Yeah. I'm opening the Grammy. And by the way, sexy but not revealing. Thank not you. like, oh, I can't move this way, I can't yeah. move that Thank way. Thank you. She literally commanded that whole carpet in yeah, this Yeah, thing. yeah, yeah. We and can't go without talking about Janelle Monet. Yeah. Oh, can we please? We gotta pay homage. She looked extraordinary. I thought that this Armani Privé dress she wore was like Oscars ready. Mm -hmm. But of course it played for the red carpet here as well. It was so stunning. All the sequins, the way it framed her clavicle, mm -hmm. that floral detail at the waistline flowers mm -hmm. are so hot right now. Thank you so much for joining us. We'll see you for the Oscars, uh, won't we? I hope so. <laughs> you bet.